Starting off the morning with some cracked egg. Let's go ahead and drop this one off the customer right quick here. Got a bing outside the bag. There you go. Enjoy. Thank you very much. Have a great morning. Next order is going to be a BJ's order. Man, it is kind of dead slow out here right now. It's about like 11.20 or so and not much popping off, you know? You think it'd be good with all this weather being kind of cloudy? It's nice out here. It's like 74 degrees, which is awesome. Let's go pick up this. It's going to a hospital, which is, you know, not very fun to drop off. Let's grab the catering bag right here. Whoa, almost fell over. Tripped on the curb here. And we've got to go into this big hospital place right there, right? And go hand it to these people at Suite 300. Nice little bag right there. Links in the description if you guys need new catering bags. These things work pretty well. You've seen them in all of my videos. Let's go drop this off, go collect that money. We'll probably get enough money right here to pay for a brand new catering bag in case they get destroyed, because sometimes you gotta replace them. I got grease spill all inside one of my catering bags before. Had to throw it away, it kinda sucked because I only used it like two or three times, but you know, shit happens. Nice little 24 spot on that one. The next one's gonna be in North Italia. This one should be a nice one also, $8.50 plus. Let's swoop this one up, drop it off real quick to the U, another like office or something like that and see how much we get paid. Nice little banger right there, $25.88. Easy drop off. Hey look, it started raining outside. A little bit of a, a sprinkle, a drizzle right now here in Las Vegas. This doesn't happen very often, so it's nice. The temperature dropped down to like 75 74 degrees outside right now so it feels really good out here uh it's a little slower than i would expected and i think with all of the, this rain coming in that more customers would be ordering right now but it's been pretty slow for me on this wednesday is it slow for you guys uh, i'm in my discord with some other guys and they're saying it's pretty slow for them also so it might just be you know one of those days where it is just slow wherever you go no it doesn't really matter you know what market you're in just not really much is going on right now that's what it seems to be like out here look at all that completely soaked I didn't just wash my car so that's good now I'm gonna have to wash my car after this it's getting pretty soaked in here right now so we'll continue it on we'll see what happens what is it see it's 12 46 right now it's almost one o'clock and yeah it's, it's straight dead right now it's kind of different you know not not a normal Wednesday usually Wednesday Wednesdays are pretty steady here we'll see what happens throughout the day here still try and go for that $200 bag we're sitting at like about 57 60 bucks or so right now $25.03, we gotta pick up lemongrass and lime, and then we gotta go over to like a ramen place and get some ramen. I don't think the total's gonna change, but hopefully it surprises me here. Second pickup location, Soru Ramen. And once we go drop this off, I think we're gonna get $25.03. Hopefully we get a surprise, that'll be nice. Let's get both these orders dropped off at the customer's door right here. Got everything inside this bag, even the drinks are inside this bag, so. Hopefully everything went as planned and nothing went crazy, sweet. Looks good, nothing spilled. All right, take out the soups. It's a bunch of stuff. Lay it right there. Take these items out. Lay it right there. This is the Soru ramen place, which was actually just a bunch of sushi is what it was, so that's not too bad. And they got the drinks right there also. Bam, easy peasy, thank you very much. I didn't think that one was gonna change, so only got the 25.03 on that, but still not too bad. That didn't take me more than about 20 minutes to go to both of those locations and then drop it off to the customer's house. This puts me at a, a 1.45 right now, and this is usually like the slowest of the slow time. I think I am going to shoot over to my house right now and kind of just chill until about four o'clock and then shoot back out here for the dinner time. Um, after that order, that puts me at, what was I, was like about 55, 60 bucks. So that put me at, mm, like, I don't know, 80 bucks or something like that, I think is what, it, what I'm at. So not too bad, I'll come out for dinner, do about another 120 something dollars for dinner. I think we should easily be able to hit that goal in that, in that four hour time frame. But yeah, just got myself a new drone that I want to, you know, kind of do a little bit of practicing on. So let's go ahead and shoot to some B-roll. Wake up, grab my gun, and then I load it. Tie my wee man up the seeds of what I'm smoking. This Avalon water around my choker. Blue honey's got a nigga pocket swollen. Woke up for my bitch and told her that it's over. And I'm a dog, so I told her friend come over. Fuck the bitch at home and squash it cause it's over. Cause then my youngest pull up on you, then it's over. Whoa, some baked the brick cause I ain't want it. Dump my beat cause I ain't want it. Fuck that bitch. Bitch, it's over with, I'm out here chasing money. money I had to change on you, bitch, I'm 2-100 I, 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 I wake up, say my present, grab my gun and grab my fire Dinner time. Ooh, got some cannolis in here. I'm not peeking in their bag and got two pizzas also. So go ahead and load these up into one of these uh, red pizza bags right here. We're gonna go drop this one off. This one said $16 plus. 
So this is a good start to the dinner. It is about uh, five something in the afternoon already, 524. So you can see it's a little bit of a late start, but you know, going for the $200 goal or going for 8 p.m., I'm really not too sure what's gonna happen tonight. We'll try our best out there and see what happens. All right, heading to customer's house right here. It looks like I'm gonna have to go behind. This most likely is open. Uh, no, so I am guess I'm gonna be leaving it right here at the front. It's kind of an awkward one, but I guess I'll just use their little call box right there. We can just leave it right here. It says leave at the front door. I guess this is the front door for me. All right, let's get it. Quick $17 right there. As I was setting it down, the family actually came out, opened the door for me real quick, and I just handed it to them. Let's move on to the next delivery. Headed into Frankie's Uptown, a neighborhood bar. I've never been to this place before, but it's a catering order. Let's go pick this up. It looks pretty nice over here. We'll see how much we get paid once we drop it off at the at the La Familia's house. Some type of feeling you get when the order is ready to go and it's one of the catering ones. So <laughs> I love that. Walked right in. Just uh, one bag there and a little pizza. Gonna throw it into the catering bag and then uh, let's go be at the front door in the next second here. Everybody's chilling. Let's go to the front door with it. There's no hiding that I walked up to this door with all these big windows. All right, they are going to enjoy their food. That one, get the pizza out. Ooh, nice and hot still. That's how I like to do it. All right, enjoy, thank you very much. Chilling in my spot again, and it's starting to rain again. It is uh, past seven o'clock, look at that, 7.10. I'm sitting at $130 today. Now, I didn't work very hard today, I will admit it. You know, I didn't try and go hardcore like I normally do. I kind of took it easy, and you can see that's kind of maybe biting me in the ass a little bit by not hitting that $200 goal. $130 is still good for the night. It's been so slow out here, I'm just kind of getting discouraged. So I'm gonna do what I pretty much preach people not to do is just give up and go home when things get tough. You know, always give up, always surrender, always point your finger and blame other people when things aren't going your way. So right now, I'm gonna go home because all the cherry pickers are out here and they're making it so I can't get any orders. So I'm gonna blame all of them of why this, this area is dead right now. Oh, I'm being facetious, guys. I'm just joking. I'm just being a jackass, you know, <laughs> being a little ass hat. But I'm gonna go get myself some food. I'm actually really am gonna call it for tonight. So I only made 130 bucks for the day, which is still cool, you know. It is what it is. Um, that puts me at roughly almost um, $600 in the last three days. So I've still almost pretty much made $200 each day. I think I'm sitting at like 580 or something like that. So maybe about 20 bucks shy, but that's still good. Hope you guys are having a good day out there. Maybe your Wednesday was fast. Maybe it was slow. Maybe it was normal. Maybe it was neutral. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below how your Wednesday was, if it kind of sucked or you know, if it was a good one, you still made your bag out there and it was just like a normal day. I'd say today wasn't really that much of a normal day, but I will catch you guys in tomorrow's video for for all of Thursday dashing. We'll go out there, we'll try and collect another $200 bag. We should be able to hit that on Thursday and then we'll smash into the weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, really hammer it hard and possibly go for $300 days on the Friday and Saturday. Sunday will be maybe about a half or short day for me because I'm gonna be doing all of my preparation to head out into Southern California, get this car ready, get everything set up into it so that I can be living in it for the next week because that's where I will be. I will be stuck in this car literally for a full week straight and it'll be very limited time that I'm outside of the car other than, you know, dropping people's food off or picking up food at the store. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourselves. Peace out. Though I kiss my son, I know these haters want to see me go. Cut these young nigga diamonds hit like the sun. Trophies round my neck like I won. Me and Johnny Dang, we got a bun. Honey K, this my diamond phone. White bitch, sloppy top, dumb. I wake up, grab my gun, and then I load it. Call my wee man up to see the world, I'm smoking. This apple water around my choker. Blue honey's got a nigga pocket swollen. Woke up, fuck my bitch, and told her that it's over. And I'm a dog, so I told her, Frick, come over. Fuck this bitch at home and squash it, cause it's over. Cause if my youngest pull up on you, then it's over. Me go get the